Hello everyone and welcome back. Um, if you've only just opened up your Dota 2, you'll notice that they have finally released a new patch with the new treasures. Now, I'm sort of a little bit happy and yet a little bit unhappy with this treasure that they have released. Um, they are good and the items, I haven't even really got to look at them yet. The only, uh, the, the matter is, is that last year I think they had the treasure of champions or something like that and you had a chance to get two couriers. I had a quick look at one and if you have a look inside they're all immortals this time around and you get a chance at one courier. Now I'm not sure if this is actually going to take um, place of the treasure of champions. I'm not too sure because I was going to do a 50 uh, chest opening for that but the way they've done this is that they they make you pay what's it uh, for? Let's have a quick look. I think yeah the five dollars for a autographed immortal which pretty much anyone can just buy so the value of that will go down that's probably the downside where last year the value of your immortal courier if you did get one um, which was the little box uh, courier and uh, I can't remember the other one um, they're worth a quite a fair bit they're around 50 bucks up to a hundred and something dollars if you you know if you get the right time of the market so these will probably not be worth a lot only because everybody can buy them. Um, the Curia, on the other hand, will probably still be worth a little bit, maybe around $15 to $16, and hopefully go up in value. Um, but other than that, man, these items look frigging amazing. And one I'm really, really excited about is <laughs> the Immortal uh, for Skyrath, because I love uh, Skyrath, and that looks absolutely crazy. So let's have a quick look anyway. Um, the way I've done it is I've brought all autographed. I've brought 11, um, but I've brought two of him only because I think he, his value will go up a little bit more than the others. And I've stuck with mainly um, the panel, so because I think the panel play or well, the panels uh, people will actually go up in value. So I, you know, I, I, I've looked at the market already, and and the players are actually a little bit lower than the people on the actual. Panel of Dota, so um, let's have a look. At the first one. That looks pretty sick. Yeah, I'm really keen to look like uh, to look and see what they look like in game because I know that um, I know that this one here apparently has a custom effect for his ability. So I'm not too sure, but um, yeah, it's supposed to have some sort of custom effect. As you can see here, you can't really see any. Custom effects on these, but that looks crazy. Look at the size of that thing. Just whack some. Don't play uh, Razor a lot, but that's not bad at all. Very nice. And what's this? What is it? It's tombstone. Oh, it's his new tombstone. That looks crazy. And there it is. It's the little Doomling Immortal Courier. So that will be the Courier for the uh, International, obviously. Um, I have seen this online already and it has a flame effect on his sword. You can see, you can't see much there. Alright, let's get stuck into them. Um, we'll open up five of the singles, and then hopefully after the five, if I don't get the Immortal Courier, we'll go with the two of him. Because if we get the Immortal uh, with his autograph, well then it's probably worth a little bit more. So let's go. That's alright, we'll keep going. He's got nothing, that's right, I forgot. He's got no sets at all. About time they start pushing some out, I think. I really do hope they still bring out the other chest, to be honest. I really thought they'd bring out the, the uh, TI4 uh, hero sets, but yes, yeah. 
Sticking with these, obviously, because this is making them a lot more money, $5 each. So no courier as yet. Are we at, at the fifth? Yes, so we'll go with... Fingers crossed we get... We get it now. Come on. Damn. Damn, damn, damn. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Had no luck last video. Give me some luck. Come on. No. That's right. We'll equip that. I'm happy. I'm still happy. On. Live. Purge the last. Oh. Who did I get it with? I got it. Boom. There she is, boys and girls. Let's equip that. That's very nice. That's by Toby as well, which I'm pretty happy about. That's not bad. It's not bad at all. Toby one. Wonder what the chances are of getting another one. A pretty damn slim, I would say. Uh, la, 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 la. Lucky last, and who is it? It's Purgy boy. Let's see how you go for me, mate. Come on. Got a good feeling. Hang on, what chest is it? 70. Ooh, 70 series. Come on, mate. You can do it for me. Da -da -da -da. Oh, actually, that's not bad. At least it's my favourite item. That's good. That's good. You've done. You've done well. Um. All right. Now, if that is the TI chest for this year, um, I will be doing another opening, and I'm gonna actually try to do. I know it sounds crazy. But I'm going to try to do every single person in this store on the next uh, video if it is the only chest that they're bringing out for this tournament. If um, if it's not, then obviously I'll wait until they release it. Um, and for this video, guys, I am going to be giving away one of those um, Immortals. Just put down in the comment section the um, link to your Steam ID or Steam profile, rather. And... Um, just put in who you think, what hero is going to get the most amount of kills in the, this year's tournament. Easy as that. Just put a simply put the hero you think is going to get the most amount of kills and the link to your Steam profile and I'll randomly select one of you guys to take on, take home one of those uh, uh, doubles that I received there. Let's have a quick look. Wow. I've actually got, I've got three um, of those. So it might be, might be one of them. All right, thanks for watching, guys. Make sure you subscribe, like, try to share the video, and um, stay tuned for the next one, which is coming up either today, uh, tomorrow or the next day. Cheers, guys.